Psalm 130, a song of ascents. Out of the depths I have cried to you, O Lord. Lord, hear my voice. Let your ears be attentive to the voice of my supplications. If you, Lord, should mark iniquities, O Lord, who could stand? But there is forgiveness with you that you may be feared. I wait for the Lord, my soul waits, and in his word I do hope. My soul waits for the Lord, more than those who watch for the morning, yes, more than those who watch for the morning. O Israel, hope in the Lord, for with the Lord there is mercy, and with him is abundant redemption. And he shall redeem Israel from all his iniquities. Psalm 131, a song of ascents of David. Lord, my heart is not haughty, nor my eyes lofty. Neither do I concern myself with great matters, nor with things too profound for me. Surely I have calmed and quieted my soul like a weaned child with his mother, like a weaned child is my soul within me. O Israel, hope in the Lord from this time forth and forever. Psalm 132, a song of ascents. Lord, remember David and all his afflictions, how he swore to the Lord and vowed to the mighty one of Jacob. Surely I will not go into the chamber of my house or go up to the comfort of my bed. I will not give sleep to my eyes or slumber to my eyelids until I find a place for the Lord, a dwelling place for the mighty one of Jacob. Behold, we heard of it in Ephrathah. We found it in the fields of the woods. Let us go into his tabernacle. Let us worship at his footstool. Arise, O Lord, to your resting place, you and the ark of your strength. Let your priests be clothed with righteousness, and let your saints shout for joy. For your servant David's sake, do not turn away the face of your anointed. The Lord has sworn in truth to David, he will not turn from it. I will set upon your throne the fruit of your body. If your sons will keep my covenant and my testimony which I shall teach them, their sons also shall sit upon your throne forevermore. For the Lord has chosen Zion, he has desired it for his dwelling place. This is my resting place forever, here I will dwell, for I have desired it. I will abundantly bless her provision, I will satisfy her poor with bread. I will also clothe her priests with salvation, and her saints shall shout aloud for joy. There I will make the horn of David grow, I will prepare a lamp for my anointed. His enemies I will clothe with shame, but upon himself his crown shall flourish. Psalm 133, a song of ascents of David. Behold, how good and how pleasant it is for brethren to dwell together in unity. It is like the precious oil upon the head, running down on the beard, the beard of Aaron, running down on the edge of his garments. It is like the dew of Hermon, descending upon the mountains of Zion, for there the Lord commanded the blessing, life forevermore. Psalm 134, a song of ascents. Behold, bless the Lord, all you servants of the Lord, who by night stand in the house of the Lord. Lift up your hands in the sanctuary and bless the Lord, the Lord who made heaven and earth. Bless you from Zion. Psalm 135. Praise the Lord. Praise the name of the Lord. Praise him, O you servants of the Lord. You who stand in the house of the Lord, in the courts of the house of our God. Praise the Lord, for the Lord is good. Sing praises to his name, for it is pleasant. For the Lord has chosen Jacob for himself, Israel for his special treasure. For I know that the Lord is great, and our Lord is above all gods. Whatever the Lord pleases, he does, in heaven and in earth, in the seas and in all deep places. He causes the vapors to ascend from the ends of the earth. He makes lightning for the rain. He brings the wind out of his treasuries. He destroyed the firstborn of Egypt, both of man and beast. He sent signs and wonders into the midst of you, O Egypt, upon Pharaoh and all his servants. He defeated many nations and slew mighty kings. Sion, king of the Amorites, Og, king of Bashan, and all the kingdoms of Canaan, and gave their land as a heritage, a heritage to Israel his people. Your name, O Lord, endures forever. Your fame, O Lord, throughout all generations. For the Lord will judge his people, and he will have compassion on his servants. The idols of the nations are silver and gold, the work of men's hands. They have mouths, but they do not speak. Eyes they have, but they do not see. They have ears, but they do not hear. Nor is there any breath in their mouths. 
Those who make them are like them. So is everyone who trusts in them. Bless the Lord, O house of Israel. Bless the Lord, O house of Aaron. Bless the Lord, O house of Levi. You who fear the Lord, bless the Lord. Blessed be the Lord out of Zion, who dwells in Jerusalem. Praise the Lord.